Gaffer, um, another big scalp this time uh, against the champions. Yeah, uh, yeah, it was like two halves again. I think um, first half was probably the best we played all season uh, against a very good side. Um, yeah, we were brilliant first half. If anything, I think we should have been more than one nil up. And then the game's very, very different. But um, yeah, and then the last twenty minutes was uh, yeah we had to hang in and uh, yeah just two sides of a performance. But honestly, the first half and the way that we played it was. Um, that was uh, that's the best we played all season. Uh, I thought we were brilliant. Were you pleased with how we approached the game, given I suppose Pompey were in party mode? Yeah, like uh, I read what uh, Portsmouth said. They wanted 100 points. Um, they're on a whatever 16, 17 game unbeaten run. Uh, yeah, no, we wanted to win this game. Uh, I've got fans travelling to and paying to travel here, so I want to win. Yeah. Please for Luke Chambers, his first tick goal, first professional goal as well. I didn't know that. Yeah, no, uh, yeah, brilliant for. Um, Going for Luke, um, yeah, he was very good. The, the position that he was taking, uh, either either left back or left midfield today, really really hurt them first half. So um, yeah, it was very good. Trying to bring him back again next season if you can. Oh yeah, I'd love to have him next season. Uh, but he's at a he's at an amazing club. Um, normally with these loans, if they have a very positive loan, they step up a division. Um, I'll see. Uh, he's been brilliant, brilliant lad. Um, and yeah, different positions. I played him left wing back, left centre back today. I played him when we had the ball, it was almost like a left six, and he was brilliant. Came close through Johnny Smith just before uh, Luke's goal, and Johnny's been very good, hasn't he, in recent weeks? Yeah, Johnny's really stepped up. Um, I think, uh, if anything, I need more from Johnny next season. I think uh, he had a really unlucky sort of first three, four months with injuries with us. He needs a full pre season, and then I think he's a very good player. Uh, I think there's lots more to come. We had chances, Chamberlain had chances first half, Marshall Hall in, the, in those wide areas. Um, I loved what we did first half. We should have, um, one thing I'll say is that we should have, if it's been really critical, we should have been more than one. We were that good. Um, and then the game turned into the opposite. We had to hang in, goalkeeper made amazing saves, we had to put heads uh, in where it hurts, and yeah, we did. Just on that second half, Josh came on, took his goal well, didn't he? I thought Josh was brilliant when he came on. I thought Charlie Kyleman was really good with what he does in running in behind. And um, Josh came on, and two centre backs really struggled to deal with his physicality and showed speed, power, and brilliant finish. So in the end, it won us a game. A little bit of a scuffle towards the end, much in that? No, not really. I think I think that shows you like they were desperate to win. We were desperate to win, and um, yeah, it's just competitive. Uh, the captain's a very good player. I love Scott Smith. Doesn't matter the size of any opponent, he's going toe to toe. And uh, nah, nothing in that. It's uh, two teams wanting to win. Just uh, you mentioned Sam made some big, big saves again today, didn't he? Yeah, he does. Yeah, I think that second half turned into it. I think that's what I. Uh, we've had that a couple of times now. We've played Lincoln the first thirty minutes. We were, we were, we were very, very good. And I just need us. Uh, I need us to be better next year, better and for longer. And that's what uh, that's what I'm going to have to challenge the players is that. We can play like that for 45 minutes, but can we play for, for 90, 95 minutes? If we do, then, as you've seen, we can be as good as any team. Um, so we know where we need to improve, but some of the football today was was so good in that first half. I don't know the number off the top of my head, but Portsmouth were on a very a long unbeaten run, I think, and again, it's another scalp, another big club. Um, and the fans will go on happy and a great effort for them to come down today. Yeah, amazing. I'm so happy we won. I know we had to dig in at the end, but. Long way for them to travel. Uh, I can uh, say it every week. Uh, something uh, about what the support have done for for me, for our players, for the club in general. Oh, yeah, they mean um, yeah, they mean a lot to me um, in different parts of my career. So I'm really glad I can give them moments like today. Finally, just a quick line on Pompey. We gave them that guard of honour at the start of the game and. You know the table doesn't lie. I suppose they've been the best, best team this season. Yeah, they're the best. Uh, yeah, they've been the best team over the course of the season. Very, very efficient. Really, they can do both sides of the game, as you saw towards the end when they put six, seven uh, players in our box. They've got players that can attack it, but they can also play. So, um, no, well done to the coaching team. Well done to their owners. They invested very wisely, and obviously Langy's gone up with them. So, um, nah, I've got nothing but good, good things to say about this club.